Hey guys, it's Annie here today. I haven't done that intro for a while. <laughs> so, yeah. I'm doing my September book haul today, and it's pretty tiny. Like, I bought three books. So proud of that, though. So proud. Tried not to buy many books, and I didn't. And I'm very happy about that. So, yeah. But October may be a little bit crazy for book buying, because all the new book releases... So, yeah, let's get started. First book I got this month was a pre-order. I pre-ordered it in August, I think. And that is The Jewel by Amy Ewing. Um, it's very pretty. Um, I loved it. I read this in one sitting and I gave it 5 out of 5 stars. And I loved it. And I took a quiz afterwards, like a few weeks. And on Epic Reads, and I got Violet, the main character, as who I am most like. And I do agree with that a little bit. <laughs> Just some things in the book that happened that I probably would have done. I pre-ordered The Infinite Sea by Rick Yancey. Um, the cover is gorgeous again. Um, can you say cover by? <laughs> I have not read The Fifth Wave yet, but... Let's see if I can grab the fifth wave without knocking everything over. I got the fifth wave for my birthday, so if you haven't watched my birthday book haul, then you might not know that. <laughs> but yeah, I bought this because I was thinking that I could read the fifth wave really quickly. And then I remembered that the fifth wave is kind of long and that it probably wouldn't fit in my backpack because Air of Fire barely did. I mean, it might fit because it is a little bit smaller, but Air Fighter, eh, Air Fighter, what? Air Fighter did get a little beat up in my backpack, so I might be reading that over a break soon. And I'll be reading this one too because I'm just going to marathon them. I've heard that these are amazing from Emma, from a lot of people on the BookCon app, um, just from everyone, and Chloe Grace Moretz is going to be... Um, the main character Cass, or Cassie, I think. Cassie. And it comes out, like, next year, I want to say. And I'm excited for that. I have not seen Chloe Grace Smart's act, but I've heard she's amazing. And, yeah. Okay, let's try not to knock everything over. And then the last book I bought at Half Price Books for, like, $4. And it's in perfect condition, and it's a hardback. And that is blood um, Bloodline. And that is Bloodlines by Rochelle Mead. Can I talk today? No, obviously not. Um, but yeah, I had to get this because I finished the um, Vampire Academy series. And um, hmm, when was that? May, March, April, around that time. I marathoned from the third one to the sixth one and just finished it. It was amazing. I loved them all. Um, yeah, definitely read them. Um, I only have the first three on my shelf right now because my friend is borrowing the other three because she wants to finish it, but she hasn't had time to go to the library, so I just brought them to our church. But I'm so excited to read from Cindy's point of view. At least I think it is. It is... I'm just ready for more Adrian. I mean, Adrian. I did like Dimitri, but I feel like learning more about Adrian is going to be pretty awesome. Yeah, that is my extremely short book call. Um, just a reminder, my um, giveaway is up right now. It is open. If you're watching this, like, past... Um, October 4th, it will not be open, but it is open currently, and today is the 29th of September, and I am giving away, I'm giving away a copy of The Kiss of Deception, so go check out that video if you would like, um, and yeah, 